Hello, my name is Alexander Skank, and I would like to you to meet Jackobot. Inside, we have a robot and a spider. So, what this is is one motor. This one right here makes this turn, and then that pulls the eyes in and out. And then you have this sensor and this sensor, which are push, sens push sensors for buttons out here. This motor is a treat motor. This turns down, which releases a treat. And this this sensor right here is a light sensor, but it's actually just a light right now. Makes this um, nose light up. And then below it, you can't see it, but this is a distance sensor. It looks for something, and then when it see something, it makes it slow move light up. Hi there. So let's see it in action. Okay. Put the lid back on. Makes it look a lot scarier. Mm -hmm. So narrator, which one should we do first? Oh, let's demonstrate the flashing nose first and then explain how the buttons work. Okay, so in order to make the nose flash, you wave in front of the mouth, and then while it's flashing, you have to hold in one of these buttons until it's done. Okay, well, so let's, let's go with a trick. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Why should they be clapping? It's proud of itself, I guess. Okay, so now a treat? Yeah. Okay. Oopsie, let's get it unclogged and try that part again. Remember to stop the program. You know the coolest part of robots? What? You get to learn to troubleshoot. So up inside of here, we've got a little chute. Oh, it just got jammed up, huh? Yep. As we were saying, we've got this little chute. And when everything's going just right. Okay, now, you want to try that again, audience? Yeah, let's do that again. Okay. Get that. Okay, treats, here we go. Um, what there you got go, there? you get to keep that. What is it? Some nerds. Some nerds, all oh right. Oh, man. Not again. Oh, oh it's okay. I just, see. Just tell it to pause. Alex, just tell it to pause. It's okay. So now that we saw it actually going, show us again in here. Um, you said that one of the motors makes the eyeballs fall out. Move that motor with your hand and let's see the eyeballs fall out part happen. Okay. There's a trick. So you just move that lever, and it pulls that string, that which makes the eyeballs go in and out. And then the candy dispenser part, how does it go? Well, when he's actually going, this guy controls him. Yeah, okay. Hi, little guy. So, that goes down, and then that falls out. falls out. Okay, so you said this guy, look, this little guy over here controls him, huh? Or at least that's the story we've been telling. So what actually well, happens? Not exactly. What actually happens? How does it how does it really work? Back over here, come on, come on, audience. You have a NXT brain. Okay. And so you have buttons to choose whichever program you want. So this is trick or treat. So you run your program. Or, and then to back out of it, you press the 
black button. Okay, so once you get your program run, and then what happens next as far as the robot and the sensors and all that are concerned? Show us over here what happens next to make something happen. So you get the program running, and then you said something about waving your hand. Oh, yeah. You wave your hand in front of the mouth or this. So the distance sensor sees your hand. And then that, the um, nose, lights up. So the light sensor emits its light, right? Yeah. Okay. Which is behind the nose. Right, okay. And then you said something about push sensors earlier? Yeah. These two little buttons, right. you can see the push sensor in there. Okay. Yeah, I see it. And then you also have the tree. Which has got a push sensor hooked to it, too. Okay, I gotcha. So if you hold those buttons and while the light's flashing, yeah. then what does the actual robot do? Then what? it um, tells either this motor or this motor to move. Oh, so it tells it to rotate, and then does it rotate twice right away, or what? Just one. Actually, no, half. And then it pauses. This one is half, this one's a quarter. Okay, and then it pauses and goes back the other way, so it's ready for the yeah. next time. Okay, so um, show us that one more time with the treat side. Okay. So there's the distance sensor, there's the push sensor. And here comes the motor, Ooh. and there's the nerds. Here you go, you get okay. to keep that. So now show us one more time over here on the trick side. Just leave the nerds on the table, it's fine. Okay. Now it... Oh, okay, stop the program and start it again. And now it's just started again, it'll be fine. No. Just start it again, it'll be fine. It's thinking about getting this up. Okay, and well, so then go ahead and move. And so it won't get... it won't do it. Okay. So now, for trick. And there's the motor that goes down, and the motor that goes back up. All right. So do you want to see how it works inside when it no, does I, that? I think we get the idea. So okay. tell us so tell us what your favorite part about building this robot was. Troubleshooting. Troubleshooting? Yeah. And did you ever think you'd see a robotic chuck lantern? Of course. Oh. Anything is possible. Well, what did your friends at school think about it? What did your friends at school think about it? <sighs> Happily yay! They thought what? Yay. They thought yay? Did, did you show it to a lot of people? Yes. When did you show it to them? At school. Okay. Like... Just, you brought it to your class, or what? To my class and all over the school, which the narrator did, which is... Oh, Alex's dad, Michael. Yes. So, so... IT director. What about that, the thing that happened that evening? Tell us about that. Oh, um, there was a thing called a harvest festival yeah. at my school. And, um, we had this robot there, and, well, let's say that a lot of people got tricks and treats. So kids got and to come kids up. And kids smaller than the pumpkin itself got to do both. So kids got to come up and do it themselves? All right. Were they pretty surprised, too? Yes. Hmm. All right. How many kids do you think got to come up and do it? Three bags full of nerds. Oh my gosh. Plus more. Well, that's pretty cool. So probably four. All right, well, we'll see you next time, okay? Okay. Do you have any closing thoughts? Um, only that if you have a, um, a geek dad book, and uh, dad, and it's Halloween, and you've got stuff plus an NXT. Get, or you don't have an NXT. Get the NXT. Carve your pumpkin. This is an awesome project. All right. Well, we'll see you again soon, okay? Yep. Bye bye. See ya.